Happening this week is one of the biggest events of the year for food lovers, Birmingham Restaurant Week. It's now in its 10th year. It begins tomorrow. CBS 42 News reporter Connie Gasky live at home with, with a look at some of the restaurants participating. Connie, good morning. Good morning, Art. I'm here at Lucky Cat Rolled Creams in downtown Homewood. They're among more than 50 restaurants participating. They've got ice cream. They've got lunch, all kinds of good stuff. We're going to talk to their owner in a live interview coming up in just a little bit. But we're also talking about some of the other restaurants that are participating in Restaurant Week this year, including one that's on the other side of Homewood. We're talking about Ash Neighborhood Bar and Grill. They're in West Homewood, a wood-fired grill, and they're all about the locally sourced ingredients. Just celebrated their one-year anniversary last week. So this is their first time participating in Restaurant Week, and for their owner, it's an experience he's been looking forward to. It's funny, 10 years ago, I was at Highlands when the very first Restaurant Week um, happened, and Frank was such a big part of that. Um, so I got to see that from the very, very first one, and then having my own place 10 years later and being here for the 10-year anniversary and participating is, is a very uh, poetic. He, of course, is talking about Frank Stitt, the award-winning executive chef at Highlands Bar and Grill. Driscoll worked there, and now he's working on his own concept in West Homewood. So it's a, a new restaurant for him. Again, only about a year old. He's kind of trying to build the business there. Restaurant Week can certainly help out with that a lot. You'll hear from him about how much he hopes this makes a difference for him coming up in the next half hour. Live in Homewood, Count on Gasquee, CBS 42 News. Local coverage you can count on. Yeah.